digging in before the ice cream melts. What did I get back home with? Uh, I just got this uh, small box uh, for 999 and got almost around 10 books. Just let me just show you what did I actually get. And this is the first book that I got. It's Lorna Dune by rd blackmore even i don't know what to expect out of this but it was in the classics section and it's part of the penguin popular classics and then looks good enough then the second book is tom jones a very popular classic by henry fielding and can have a look at the cover it looks like probably it's a very old book or or yes they have some scratches over here no not a very fresh one but then it's an old one looks good enough though then the next one is Dreer's English. But then my cousin got this book for herself. Well, I do not know what this thing is about. It's mostly about guide, clarity and style. But then hopefully I'll find it out from her after she goes through it. then this book caught a little bit of my attention by sandeep and deep the last war because i was thinking of uh, exploring some more uh, of these indian writers hopefully it'll turn out to be a nice one a nice read then the other one is called mindset the new psychology of success and this book uh, my cousin got this book for herself looks more like of a psychology book yeah i do not know i'll find it out from her and the other one is tea time for the traditionally built by Alexander McCall Smith I don't know what to expect out of this no no idea but then I just I just bought it I do not know why this one by Graham Greene the humor fact the human factor this one by Ernest Hemingway the last interview and other conversations so i have read many of hemingway's uh, writings and this thing actually is an interview yes and that that is what interested me about this book And now this one is by Neelam Sarangar, Requiem in Raga, Janki. Looked interesting, so, so I just ended up getting it. And the last one, last one is none other than the Bhagavad Gita, a verse translation by Joffrey Parinder. Well, hopefully this is going to be a 
smaller translation but then worth enough my understanding because reading the actual Gita is certainly quite difficult for me if it's not in translation because I am not very well versed with Sanskrit hopefully this will give me some kind of a some kind of a comprehension about the whole act the actual book so that was in all and keep following the book potato for more see you next time